Legend in the making on the driver's seat, man. Yes, sir. Appreciate you fucking back with me. You already know, man. You're a historian. You one of them people you gotta get on the platform every week. You the nah, TK Kirkland. Sure. You know what I'm saying? You the TK Kirkland, what you the John sure. Sally. You yeah. know what I'm saying? <laughs> John so, Sally. So we gotta fuck with you, you know what I'm saying? For sure. You the man in the city, shit. One thing I gotta know, cause shit, since I did my last interview with you, it's been hella progression. It's been steady growth you know what i'm saying the Always. last time we did an interview you was not even doing vi uh, videos no more you was just doing the uploads you kind of back shooting again mm -hmm. but the main thing i gotta know is how did the hell you get a million subscribers before say cheese like how does the, why do you think that is you know what i'm saying just from a um, youtube perspective i know exactly why it is um hit songs go way further than hit interviews okay so you know what I'm saying? I got shit like that's on me and a lot of other big videos on my channel. So yeah, that's that's why. That's exactly why. That's like, a good so, yeah, content that's a good brings subscribers. Nothing you can beg people to subscribe to you all day. It won't mean nothing without the content. Yeah, I feel you on that. Down. That's a good observation. And what do you consider yourself these days? Because you was a videographer, but I don't really look at you like that no more, bro. I, I think that's damn near like the lowest thing on your list right now. It really is. I mean, I'm still a videographer. I'm going to be a videographer, but that's not what I'm really focused on right now. I'm more, yeah. I don't know. Are you an A&R? Are you a manager, CEO? Like, what would you? I'm all that. I'm yeah. all that one. <laughs> Whatever you want to call that. I don't yeah. know. I'm trying to be a mogul. Yeah. Is, is that the plan overall? I mean... Cause right now you're doing the reviews. Like I feel like, mm. are you helping break artists? Is that part of the plan? Is that's, it just a I'm hustle? Just trying to, yeah, that's that's my way to find talent, and it's a hustle too at the same yeah. time. I am making money from it, but you keeping it. It's a, yeah, it's yeah. A, I'm I'm helping people at the same exactly. time too. People who otherwise wouldn't probably have that platform, and then exactly. I'm finding me too. I'm finding some artists through your platform that I would have never heard a song that I might like now, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Shit exactly. like that, so, and then, yeah, I think it's a double whammy. You doing that, and I like how you having a guest on there every week. Yeah. So you yeah. feel like, do you feel like it's actually helping artists, the reviews? Most definitely, ask the artists. They yeah. telling me, they yeah. telling me, they telling the people, They it's most definitely helping people. Yeah. The people that's really worth it, it's gonna help them, for sure. Yeah, so you doing that, uh, you got the Sid Streets. Tell them, tell them about that, man. What we doing with the the Sid Streets? Oh yeah, we got the Sid Factory for sure. We, yeah. uh man, it's, it, you know, it's regular business. It's still yeah. going on. Whatever you want, you want some treats, some yeah. sweets, yeah, sweets you desire. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Come fuck with us. Yeah, you got it going. So that's just more of expanding what you got going. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. What do you see next, man? Like, I mean, you got everything going. I keep seeing shit change. In yeah. six months to a year, it's gonna be something else. Like, what do you always. think is next? I don't for know. You? I'm always, I'm always trying to stay ahead of the curve. I don't know. That's when I get in my um. That's when I get in my panic mode and I start trying to figure out what's next. I gotta remind myself because every time I figure out what's next, it's never nothing that I thought about. It just a, it's just something that just comes to come, me. Yeah. So I can't sit there and stress about what's next because that's what I was wondering. Because like with the music reviews. People have done shit like that before, but it seemed like when you did it, it was the perfect timing, mm -hmm. and it felt like a new platform. It felt like it's shaking the city up a little bit. Yeah, I mean, people done did it before. With music reviews, bro, it's really about how many people care about your opinion. Yeah. Because anybody can do I done had, when I started doing music reviews, I seen other rappers trying to do music reviews and shit. I'm like, yeah. bro, that don't, like, yeah, you that can't, don't <laughs> you can't, don't even make sense. You yeah. can't be a rapper and not and not even a hot rapper at that yeah. trying to do music to reviews. Biased. Yeah. Like it don't work like that. Yeah. Like I seen even I seen Peso Peso doing it. It worked for him because he's hot. Yeah. People care about his opinion. Yeah. If people don't care about your opinion then it's not going to work. But how did you become that guy? Like how did you become that guy in the city? Cuz I do feel like damn, are you 
I guess the term gatekeeper, that's just a term that's used pretty lightly, but yeah. you kind of one of those guys that I feel like that your opinion do matter. People do care about it, mm -hmm. and it's something like, damn, you're another outlet now that's competing with these other blogs or whatever you want to call it, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, how did you gain that from being a videographer? We don't really normally see that route, you know what I'm um, saying? I really don't know. It's just, I don't know, consistency, hard work, and... and yeah. Putting that content out there, it just it just became that way. And then once I once I build my name as a videographer, I just I just start putting my face out there more, so people could actually know who half paint is, and not just be a nigga behind the camera type shit. Exactly. Because at first, a lot of people didn't even know what I look like. Yeah, yeah. Not everybody know what I look like. Yeah, you a brand. Mm -hmm. I was just thinking on the way here. I was like, now half paint really. I think you could be a DJ, or you could fuck <laughs> around and uh, do an event. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, and your I, brand and I got am. that big. Yeah. It's coming. It's coming. I'm yeah. working on that. So me, I, me and hit that. I, I was just going to ask you, do you think you're more important than hit that? Who more important, like a blog or the DJs like a hit that? Who we, more important It all right matters. We all, it all comes together. We can't all, we can't just break an artist with just one of us alone. It takes all of us together. But nobody is doing that. Nobody's, nobody's putting all coming of together. It together. Yeah. But, me and hit that. I'm, me and hit that. Fit put some shit together to where, and yeah. we putting more people in 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 position with it to where, we all working together for sure. That makes sense. Shit, why is the hype so big for PMG guy right now? Man, I don't know. He is hard. He, that guy? he hard, bro. Yeah, he the next NBA. He I, hard. They saying NBA. That's what, that's what I think. I mean, it depends on it depends on the route he go though. He, if, if he if he if he start if he finish working on his craft he keep working on his craft getting better with the music yeah he already got the background niggas know he ain't you know what i'm saying he ain't yeah. faking yeah 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 it just i don't know he, he come with it but he can most definitely be that guy for sure is yeah yo done or is he gonna be that guy when he get Fuck out of jail no. he gonna niggas be the, can't wait he, till yeah yo get out he gonna be the legend when he get out he gonna be bigger than ever boom. i think like so. boom i think so yeah. i'm gonna make sure of it i was gonna say do you got you gotta be involved with the shit. Absolutely. Man, when Yayo get out, we start all the way up from square Part one. Two. Yeah. That's what I wanted to know. Like it seemed like at some point a nigga gotta deal with you at some point. Is that is that the case in DFW? Do, do a nigga gotta go through hell pain at some point? It ain't a nigga that ain't went through me. Yeah. Cause I was like, okay, damn, how much credit do you deserve for Tuzi and Erica Banks? Should you get some money for them? Do you deserve it? I mean, as far as as far as with Tuzi, me and Tuzi was making hella money together. Yeah. Tuzi don't owe me a goddamn thing. We was getting money together for sure. Yeah. With Erica, I mean, I can't say I deserve no money, but if a finder's fee was to come with that on some shit, then yeah, but it is what it is. Yeah. It wasn't no paperwork, so I can't say I deserve it. I mean, yeah. I ain't locking in but like that. I was just helping. Some type of credit, though. Like, what? Because now... Look at everybody know I get record. I get the credit. Everybody yeah. knows. She knows. She said it. She exactly. knows. Exactly. Because I feel like in what we do, because I consider myself in the behind the scenes nigga, that is important for somebody to at least say, half pint did this. Yeah. This person did that. It always, like, I said that when she first signed, even if she not with us no more, the bigger she get, it just helps us out because that always, everybody already knows that that started from right here in Top Out. Yeah. So, it is what it is. I, I yeah. fuck with it. I want her to get big as possible. Yeah. Everybody, anybody that ever fucked with me. Yeah, and, and, that, and that's how it should be, shit. I like that. It ain't no hate. It ain't no hard feelings. And it's still love mutually. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. Shit, so the, another thing I want to ask you on some DFW business, and this shit, I ain't trying to be messy now, but is OG Bobby Billions a one-hit wonder? Like, I just got to get to the bottom of it. Is he, is he done? He popping his shit on the interviews? Me personally, I don't know. Bobby Hart is fucked to me. I love yeah. his music. Yeah. And then people starting to say like he only make one type of music. He can't make music without choirs in the back. I love that sound. Yeah. So I don't know. I love that shit. People talk shit, but I shit talking shit don't do nothing but bring more views. So should he be more humble, or you don't think so? Um, I agree with like what Tune was saying. Like he should shut up sometimes because because like. I don't know, Tom. Sometimes, yeah, you should be more humble. Yeah. But what he's saying, not wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The shit that he's saying ain't wrong at all. But you know, sometimes the internet takes shit and blow it way out of proportion, yeah. and shit like that. So 
I don't know. I love Bobby Music, though. Do you think DFW as a whole will have another era like 2016, 2015 around, you know, the Yayos, Yellow, Mo3, five, six artists popping at the same time? You know what I'm saying? It Which can. you was pretty much a part of. Man. It yeah. can, but Do you see everybody, that right now? everybody that's coming out right now is just doing the same shit that those guys was doing. Yeah. Yeah, and, and everybody's pretty much tired of that, so I don't know. They gotta find a different route. Yeah, it's the beef and shit over with. You That's think? over with. Yeah, we need a new. That's man. over with. Yeah, nobody's really lasting off this shit. shit. Yeah, yeah, nobody's lasting off this shit. Yeah, these I'm, niggas dying, going to jail, or it's just burning out. Once you ain't got, once you ain't beefing no more, you ain't got nothing else to talk about. Yeah, I know you might have seen this online and laughed at it. Can K-Twine go hit for hit with Lil Ray? <laughs> you already knew what I was going to say. <laughs> Come on, man. Well, K-Twine would be trolling, man. I fuck with K-Twine. He be trolling, man. He know damn well he ain't yeah. going hit for hit with Lil Ray. Or Trap. Yeah, why did he say that? Just for attention and shit? I mean, shit, it's working. We talking about yeah, it right know, now, right. so shit. That shit crazy. That's what he doing it for. It's working, yeah. but I don't think that's the right route. He only take that route. Yeah. That ain't the right route, but. That shit funny. It's working for him, shit. It's shout out K-21, man. Yeah, shout out K-21, man, with your, with your goofy ass. <laughs> <laughs> now, are you satisfied with the top off position? Like, where y'all at in Texas and DFW, the label, the business, are y'all, are you satisfied where y'all click is? You know Fuck I mean? no. I'm yeah. never satisfied. Yeah, I like that. I'm never satisfied, bro. Yeah, what you, what you think y'all got to, I mean, do? I mean, I think y'all solidify. Everybody know, but what Everybody is know, but we still, I, f I still feel like we not, we them guys, but we not them guys. Like, people yeah. still sleep on us. Like, we need, I don't know, we not, we not, we not controversial enough. Like, yeah. we not beefing with nobody. Nobody on top of beefing with nobody, hell, besides me. But I ain't even beefing with nobody. It's just, yeah. you know, I'm, I'm, I'm at the top, so people gonna, people gonna talk shit about me, and I am not holding my tongue to talk shit back. Yeah. That just, that just is what that is, but. I don't know. People just don't be recognizing what we're really doing out here. We yeah. know what we're doing. We yeah. do it, but yeah, as far yeah. as as far as the public eye goes, we just gotta catch them, and we trying to figure that out. And shit. So what all you got going right now? So you got the artist, you got the label, videography. I see you doing know, some gamer shit. Mm -hmm. What all we got going right now, man? Just give me the shit. list of what the half fun Every, shit. Got. Everything you just said. Yeah. Artists, gaming. Yeah. The motherfucking videography, of course, always. See it um, factory going See it factory. Yeah. Man, it's going on. Yeah, <laughs> I, I fuck with it. It's the biggest business, man. You staying consistent. You still elevating and shit. I, like I said, we don't even want to predict what's next. We just going to sit back and watch, man. Exactly. Anything you got to get off your chest? Any shout outs, anything before we get out of here? Man, shout out Top Off Business. Yeah. <laughs> biggest business. <laughs> at, at the, that's always what I say. Shout out Top Off Business. Shit, you already know, man. We got a legend in the making here, Half Pint, John Sally, you know what I'm saying? TK Kirkland. <laughs> Shit, you already know. Another one, and we running it back. Appreciate you for fucking with me, bro. You already know.